Hello friends, welcome back to Evans Tech. Well, um, in this video, I am going to demonstrate how to attach virtual machines to VHD to your host machine as a default drive so that you can copy the data directly from your host machine to the VHD and attach the VHD back to your virtual machine. Okay, so to start with, you have to shut down the virtual machine or turn it off. Once you do that, look for the VHD. VH is location. In my case, it's the D drive. Okay. Copy this location, right? Open disk management, and then under this, in the disk management, under actions, you will see two options. The first one is to create a VHD, and the second one is to attach a VHD. You will click on the attach VHD and paste the location of the VHD, or you can also browse to the location where the virtual machine's VHD is stored, right? You also have the option to attach the VHD to the host machine as read only. And now, since I want to demonstrate, I will not check the read only option and will attach it as it is. Once you do that, it gets added as a local disk. So you can right click the disk and click open. Okay. You see, you see all the contents from the VHD. So these are actually the uh, files present in the virtual machine's C drive. Okay. For a test, I'm going to copy a folder from my D driver test folder to this VHD and then I'll mount it back to the virtual machine to check if the data copy was successful. Alright, so I'll paste the data, test folder, contains a text file. Now I will go ahead and detach the VHD. So remember you have to detach the VHD. Once you detach the VHD, you can go back to your virtual machine and simply start it on, simply start it or pour it on. You don't have to actually remove the VHD from the virtual machine. Okay, so I start my virtual machine. So once I start the machine, you can open the C drive and confirm the, if the file was copied. In this case, you see the folder and the file. So I'll delete it. Just for all right, so that is how you copy the file or you mount the VHD of the virtual machine to the host machine. I hope you guys find it helpful. In case if you have any questions, feel free to comment. And once again, thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe and hit like. Thank you very much. Goodbye.